good evening everyone i am tv kram student of i am tv studying in first year the topic that i am going to talk on indian economic policies is the paradox of progress unlocking india's job potential india economic story is often painted in bold strokes a rapidly growing economy a rising global power however beneath the surface lies a complex reality a paradox of progress while economic indicators boost of growth a significant uh, protein of the workforce is left behind today let's dive into the reason behind this phenomenon and explore potential solutions the first thing would be like the manufacturing base traditionally manufacturing has been the engine of job creation in india however the creators and the sectors in currently stuck in a maze we face fears a global competition from countries with lower labor cost making it difficult to compete on price additionally a vast skill gap exists between the workforce and the demand of modern technology driving factories finally the complex regulation acts as roadblocks discouraging investments and hindering innovations the next thing would be like the jobless growth paradox even with economic growth new jobs aren't being created at a faster enough pace this is because the sector drives this growth information technology and financial services are not as labor in intensive this high tech sector rely on a small pool of highly skilled professionals leaving a large segment of the workforce without opportunities this in the jobless growth paradox next historical parallels let's see what are all the historical parallels from 1960s to 1970s one would be like the green revolution focus on agriculture productivity leading to temporary solutions however the current situation demands a more comprehensive approach It's like the cost of inaction the consequences of inactions are severe very high severe high unemployment and high high unemployment and stagnant wages can lead to social unrest and mass migration from rural areas to certain urban centers so how we can break this paradox let's see how uh, india being a, um, how we can how the india can break this paradox so india can overcome these challenges here are some of the points that i would like to recommend overwhelming manufacturing would like to talk about the 3 to 5 years data we need to bridge the skills gap through targeted training programs especially focus on automation and robotics streamlining regulations and attractive investments can revitalize these sectors additionally encouraging innovations in areas like advanced materials and clean technology can make indian manufacturing more competitive globally now the next point would be like skilling for the future like that would be like the ongoing process no but investing in education and skill development programs across various sectors is crucial these programs should be designed to cater to the needs of modern economy ensuring the workforce of equipped for the jobs of tomorrow this can be achieved through public partnership leveraging online learning programs and platforms to reach a wider audience the point that i would like to talk about the boosting job creations promoting entrepreneurship is the best opportunity and supporting small and medium sized enterprises can create a new employment opportunities across various sectors this requires simplifying business uh, registration processes and providing easier access to credit for aspiring entrepreneurs at the end it's all about the capital barriers to progress let's talk about some of the barriers to progress implementing these solutions won't be easy bureaucratic hurdles can delay skill development programs and infrastructure upgrades budgetary constraints can limit the scope of government initiatives so however the potential benefits for or outweighs the challenges a call to action like what can we do to overcome this let's break free from this paradox by working together the government private sector and educational sectors and the frameworks and the frame force itself can we unlock india full job potential by addressing these challenges we can ensure that everyone benefits from the nation progress creating a future where economic growth translate to shared prosperity for all the indians thank you